everyone, welcome to another video. Today I have a clothing haul. Uh, this is going to be a collective clothing haul from everything um, that I bought this month. Um, it will include clothing and accessories and I will also show the here on the side. So, let's start. Hope you can enjoy the background. Um, it is sunset. I'm trying not to film the sky so there's not much difference in light. But anyway, let's start with the first item. So, um, this is a dress and uh, it is a long dress as you will see uh, well, it's a midi dress um, uh, it's white and um, it is from, from Zara so it has this uh, this neckline, it has the straps, the straps are adjustable and uh, it is very uh, figure hugging as you will see in the, in the tryout clip um, but I really liked it uh, on the model and um, I actually thought about uh, if I should buy this dress. It is a bit too much for me. It has a very open neckline and um, well, I don't usually wear that type of uh, clothing. Uh, but uh, yes, uh, when I used it, I tried it with a uh, good old uh, shirt on top and uh, with the white linen shirt it looks really nice with some sandals uh, so I already went out like that if you follow me on Instagram there's a photo of me with that outfit uh, so yes, I like the dress very much even though the dress is made from polyester um, it is not very plastic I try to avoid uh, buy uh, things that are not, um, you know, natural uh, fabrics for summer. Uh, but again, this is a very pretty dress, and I like it very much. So that's the first thought. Okay, so let's go to the next item. Um, I uh, still attacking it. Uh, this is another midi dress. Um, well, midi. Uh, it's a bit longer on me. I'm not very tall. But um, yes, um, I really fell in love with this dress. Has this pattern, it's white, it's not crisp white. If you compare it, um, anyway, uh, this is a dress from the first dress was a Zara dress, and this one is a mango dress. So I went out um, doing some, you know random things with a cousin that is visiting me and we went through some shops as well and um, we both bought this dress because we really like how it looks um, yes, so again, this is a polyester dress as well um, but the fabric is very, very flowy and the, I mean, I really just like how the dress looks and um, how it feels as well 
and the style it wouldn't be perfect if it was you know a dress made of cotton or maybe viscose or something like that but it is not anyway I um, uh, really like this dress I think it will look, it will look really nice uh, with some uh, sneakers, you know, white sneakers in the summer, some sunglasses, and I'm ready to go. Um, it is rather simple in style, uh, but again, has that extra for the overall. Uh, yes, so this is the second item. Okay, so the next item is this skirt. And um, it is a mini skirt. It's really rather short. And it has a, a small cut um, as well. Um, it's another mango item and uh, it is all cotton actually, let me check sustainable viscose and cotton okay so it is better and um Yes, so I really liked it. I uh, really like mango. This is a mango skirt. I really like mango as a store to buy um, clothing. Oh, actually, it's 85% uh, viscose and 15% uh, linen. So it does have that type of texture that linen has um, but yes I guess it's not as rough as um, pure linen would be depending on linen sometimes when it's um, polished linen it's so it's really soft but um, I have had shirts that uh, were very uh, itchy on the skin just because they were pure linen So, I love the pattern of the skirt and the color. I mean, I, uh, as you can see with this short, uh, with this uh, shirt and many other items, uh, I really like blue and um, I think it suits my skin color and my hair color. And uh, yes, I fell in love because it's it really not it's really not an item that I would say it's um, um, an item that I can you know wear again and again. Uh, for instance, I can style a pair of uh, black jeans or white jeans in a thousand ways, but then this skirt. I mean, okay, you can wear it with a shirt or a t-shirt. But you can only wear it in summer because I, I don't think that you can I, I, I can't see a way to style it in winter even though I style white things in winter quite a lot but yes that's why I was hesitating because um, I mean uh, this was 30 euros the first dress was 50 euros so the white one and um, the last one was also 30 euros and this skirt is also 30 euros so I thought, okay, 30 euros? I mean, it's not that much but also, do I want to pay 30 euros for a skirt that I'm going, I can wear, you know, once in a blue moon and uh, yes, in summer when the weather is good but um, but my cousin was with me and she was like, why don't you just uh, put it on and see how it looks 
And that was a big mistake because I just fell in love with how it looked. You will see how it looks as well. And I bought it, so that's the story. But uh, anyway, I think that it looks really nice. And, uh, um, and yes, that's, uh, that's the item. The wind is going strong outside. But anyway, here is nice and cozy. So the next two items, I pair them together. So I'll. Uh, And the first one is a skirt. It's a black a midi skirt. And it is from a brand called uh, Edited. I bought this uh, from a website called Zalando. Um, Zalando is a carrier of different brands. You can shop everything there and they uh, ship shipping is really fast they have all types of products from home things to cosmetics and uh, I mean of course clothing and even like uh, secondhand clothing or as they call them now pre-loved anyway but uh, yes I bought the skirt there because I don't know what is up with me and the uh, midi length. Uh, maybe it's me being in my 30s. Who knows? Uh, but uh, yes, I, th I always thought that it would look good on me uh, because of my body type and everything like that. But I actually think it's uh, it looks okay. So you know what? I thought I would buy one. I really like how it looks when people style it with a um, like a sweatshirt at the top, so it's a bit of a fancier skirt, as you will see in a try on clip. Um, but I really like how people style it with like a sweatshirt or a sweater as well, or even like a leather jacket too. And of course a t-shirt or you know, a top. Um, so yes, I really liked that type of styling. So that's why I bought this skirt. And I bought this skirt. Um, I styled it with uh, this top. It's a black uh, crop top from Zara. And um, and yes, it's a you know cotton top, very simple. It has this detail. In the fabric branches up here in the middle, so um, it really hugs your body. Anyway, uh, very cute way. Um, but yes, the skirt I think was around. 30 or 40 euros uh, it's a really nice material uh, feels really silky and uh, this shirt was um, 7.95 so 8 euros and um, again this is a basic line 100% cotton and this is recycled cotton as well So it is good to know, you know, that they are using um, these tactics on their clothes as well. Anyway, let's go to the next item. Okay, so next item is a linen shirt. And uh, it is also from Mango. And um, it's a white shirt. Pure white. I won't say it's pure white, but it looks like it on camera. It has a turtle shell. Or um, 
Mother of Pearl, yeah. Mother of Pearl um, patterns. But anyway, this uh, shirt I purchased it because, I mean, of course, I wanted a uh, white linen shirt. And it is one of those soft ones. So this linen is the polished linen. So it is very soft. It is not itchy at all. Just uh, my brain, how it works. When I say itchy, I want to see Nissan. <laughs> Counting in Japanese. Anyway, it's not itchy. And uh, yes, and it works really well as well with the white dress that I wore before and uh, with a few other, I use this shirt in a few other outfits that you will see um, but yes, it has a really nice two button calf and uh, I mean it looks summery I have few linen shirts in blue color and uh, I also have one white uh, with uh, really light pink uh, stripes um, but yes, the white linen shirt that I had, that I still have, is the one that uh, was a little bit itchy and, um, and yes, I wanted a new one because uh, it was a little bit uncomfortable um, um, uh, unless I wear a t-shirt underneath, so um, if I wear a t-shirt underneath, it is fine, it doesn't itch that much but um, but yes, if I don't wear a t-shirt, so if I use a shirt alone, um, it is not comfortable so I decided to buy one that would be, um, I think this was around 40 euros so yes, it is a bit more expensive, but again, this is a good quality shirt and um, I'm hoping that I can use it for a long time uh, so it was okay so let's go to the next item okay, so uh, next few items uh, you will have seen me trying on with the white shirt and uh, this is a um, top so it, um, it's, uh, it has this uh, graduate, uh, graduate effect um, so it starts white at the top and then turns into a really light uh, purple color so, uh, this is an item from Primark I, I never used to go there because I've mentioned this before in one of my videos I don't really like the fact that fast fashion is so present in our lives and um, things are really not that good in quality I'm not saying that, you know um, it's something awful, but anyway, I try to avoid that obviously I shop in, in shops like Zara and Mango and you know and all of those are still part of uh, fast fashion but Primark, you know, the prices are so low and um, the times that I went there, people bring like the whole um, the whole cart things that they have there of clothing and all other things and I'm like why? why do you need that ma that much clothing? but you know what? Uh, my cousin again was a uh, uh, instigator in this case she really likes Primark and I'm like you know what? I'll go with you because she wanted to go and of course 
And uh, I saw this set, so this is a shirt. And the second item is a biker short. So biker short is the same color as the the end on the on the shirt. And of course, is that elastic type of um, you know? Uh, material, but um, it's okay. I think it really looks good with my skin and with the white linen shirt on top. Uh, so I bought it because first of all I never used uh, biker shorts. Uh, it uh, has been a trend for some time, but um, I didn't think that it would look well with my uh, figure, you know, body type. So I was like, okay, I, I don't think it's going to be something that I want to use or look into. But I was wrong, you know. Okay, that's uh, sometimes it's good to be probably wrong. Especially if the outcome is this cute. I really like this outfit. I used it already to go on some walks near the lake that I have here near my house. And uh, I feel really fresh, you know, and cute. Whatever. Uh, yes, so this is the, um, the things that I bought in Primark. And the next item is also from there, so let's go to that one. Okay, so the next items... Uh, I am wearing them. So it's this shirt. It's a mint uh, green shirt. Um, it's a cotton shirt from Primark. I don't, uh, uh, it doesn't fit me, it's not the right size, but I just love the, the color. And I tried it on and I uh, really liked how it looked with my skin and everything. So I was like, you know what, I can still wear it. It's the oversized oversize. Uh, yes, so... This is a 100% cotton shirt and uh, yes, I really like it. So, uh, it can be a cover up you know, for when you go to the pool or stuff like that in the summer and uh, it can also be uh, worn with, uh, I don't know, as a comfort with pajama time. Uh, yes, you know, when it's a bit chill in the, in the evening. Uh, so yes, it is huge. You will see it in a tryout. I style it with some white jeans and white uh, t-shirt. Um, but yes. And the next item is this bracelet. This is not from Primark. So you can see it has both golden and silver parts and I really like how it looked. I was um, uh, in line to pay and, uh, and yes, I saw this and I thought it was so cute that it really is different, you know, looks different. It looks a bit much. I think that I am used to a bit more um, dainty type of uh, situation for bracelets but uh, you know I don't think it looks out of place overall so uh, that's that also I bought this earrings so you can see they look Silver and part, uh, it's like a clothing pin. I thought it looked really cool, 
again I don't tend to wear uh, earrings that are this long but um, actually I didn't realize that they would, they would be so long I would prefer if uh, the pin would be together with the first one, you know uh, the first oval ring here but it is like that and um, I really like it so it's a, you know, I can pair it together with the bracelet so both of them have that silver and uh, golden part that I think that looks really cool but anyway and I think that this will also look very nice with a, with a clock with a clock with a watch uh, I have some watches in mind I want this, there has been a time some time that I want to buy a, uh, a silver and golden watch so yes, I think that if you wear this bracelet with that type of watch it will also look really stylish so yes, let's go to the next item okay, so the next item is the only item that I have from H&M and it is a pair of shorts it's very simple just uh, as a sweat pant sweat pants type of uh, shorts and again they are blue my favorite color, light blue So, yes, as you will see, I use this again as the, as with uh, the, um, the lilac suit, I use this to go on walks, uh, yes, so summer is here and um, I do have few shorts, but I don't use them very much, I don't know why I always use sweatpants I do cover my body quite a bit but uh, this time around I thought, you know what I don't really care that I have, you know, cellulite somewhere or um, I have a bit of fat as well, quite a bit but you know what, I don't care um, I think I'm old enough to Obviously, you don't need to be of any age to do whatever or wear whatever but um, when I'm wearing something that I don't feel comfortable in I don't feel well and I think that people can notice that as well so I don't feel as uh, confident and as I would can uh, as I would be able to be, you know but anyway, yes, so I bought this um, shorts just to go on walks and um, they are really comfortable, nothing special, you know I styled them with the, the white shirt, white t-shirt, white shirt on top or I also have some flannel shirts I also use this at home uh, with some flannel shirts uh, that I have so I think it looks uh, again uh, pretty cool and uh, slightly stylish and really comfortable still so let's go to the next item okay we have another black item this time is black shorts They are from Zara again, and uh, yes, so I bought uh, these shorts. They are really simple. You will see, very basic. They were twenty six euros, and uh, 
I bought, they are made from cotton as well, 100% cotton and I bought them because I have the white shorts and um, and I use them so many many times in the summer but uh, yes, I didn't have uh, any black shorts that would be this type a bit more um, classy looking, you know as if it would be a pair of pants um, yes, and I really like um, that type of outfit with this type of shorts and like a black, uh, black shirt or black t-shirt or like a black top with some, you know, something going on and some sandals as well I think it looks really cool and, uh, you know, simple, you can style it with some nice accessories, you know So yes, I got this uh, shorts because I thought that it would be nice to have something like this for the summer. They are quite lightweight and again you can style them so many ways. Um, actually, you know, there's an outfit that I was looking into and I think that this shorts would be an okay addition to that. So the outfit is a black vest top that really, you know, suits your body very well, hugs your body and this type of uh, this type of shorts I don't know why I'm visualizing that outfit um, and I think that it will look great maybe I will look like a um, like a garso you know what, they look stylish, so who cares? Uh, yes, so um, I have a vest uh, top, but it is in beige color. Really like to pair it with the uh, same color beige pants, um, suit pants, you know, and uh. Anyway, trousers and um, and a white t-shirt as well. I think it looks really cool. But yes, I think maybe if I would wear a black we uh, a vest top and then black pants, I, I think that I would definitely look like a uh, like waiter, but um, or waitress. Anyway, a garçon. Uh, and, but yes, maybe with uh, some shorts it wouldn't look like that um, Maybe I will find a black vest top and then try it And we'll see how it works Now, let's go to the last item Okay, so we have the last item The sun is really down It's almost set now, so the lighting is going crazy but we we made it, you know almost so the last item is the past not really but uh, it is, you know part of something that I really like which is sleeping these are pajama shorts uh, they are as well from Primark And I really like them because they look like uh, uh, men's underwear I don't find the idea, you know I think I saw it in a friend's TV series and um, I guess um, a few others women wearing, you know, boxers so men's underwear I don't find the idea wearing someone else's underwear appealing, you know <sighs> to each its own but anyway, I thought that it looked really cool, you know uh, 
I have a lot of pajamas. My cousin that is visiting me now, she says that I have a crazy amount of pajamas. Why do I need so much? And I'm like, pajamas are never too much, you know? Sleeping is my favorite thing, so yes. Uh, so in the shorts, they are cotton 100%. So that's that, even though they were like very, very inexpensive. I think they were around, yes, three euros and fifty cents. So three and a half euros for a pair of shorts. Oh, that's an amazing price, you know. So, yes, I think that I'll be going back a bit more to Primark because um, even though they are fast fashion type of provider I think that you can still find some good uh, fabrics there and uh, cute things so, so yes, for instance this shirt is really good quality you can say that it isn't from Zara or stuff like that, even Mango and it was only 7 euros in comparison to obviously the linen shirt always costs a bit more but if I would buy the same type of um, shirt in Zara or, or Mango they would be at least 20 or 25 type, uh, euros so yes I think I'll be a bit more flexible to this type of stores as well but anyway, uh, this video was a bit weird for me to film and, but yes, some of you have requested for me to film a styling video um, so I thought, you know what, I bought a lot of things this month and uh, so let me just um, show you what I got and style them, you know so anyway, thank you so much for joining I hope you were still able to um, enjoy this video as always, I wish you all the best and uh, please do take care of yourself I see you next time